been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. I've been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. I've been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. Filled with the Holy Ghost I am. All my sins are washed away. I've been redeemed. See this finger? I cut it jumping into my mother's rose bush. Suicide attempt or accident, I don't know, I'm just 10 years old. <laughs> this cut looks like those old boy, school, uh, boy, boy scout bloody fingers that we used to slit across and declare our allegiance to one another with. But today I did it because of Abuelita. Us kids, we hate Abuelita, my mother's mother. Hate her more than Mrs. Polka, our fifth grade teacher. You know it's the ultimate hate when you hate your grandmother more than a fifth grade teacher named Mrs. Polka. Why do we hate Abuelita so much? Well, besides the usual complaints, she pinches our cheeks too hard, gives us too little money, and always a boring story about the depression with a Mexican twist. We ate dirt burritos. <laughs> the world stops when Abuelita comes to visit, rules the house with an iron fist. Potatoes and beans for breakfast every morning in Channel 34, the Spanish language station, day and night. Weeps while she watches novelas with adulterous housewives. Shouts when the masked wrestlers and Lucha Libre fake hit each other all night long. I don't know if I did it on purpose or if Thoro pushed me. <clears throat> Another in a long list of dogs that we have owned, ranging in name from Oaxaca to Mazatlan to Puebla, named after ideal vacation spots for my dad, is running on the porch. This one's name is Thoro, later to be run over on a busy Pico Boulevard morning and renamed Tortilla. <laughs> I'm not making these up. I'm just telling you my family history. <laughs> Hold back. Abuelita sits on the porch reading yet another installment of Vanidades, sort of a cosmopolitan for the Latina set. Completely even more unrealistic than cosmopolitan, Vanidades has pictures of beautifully trimmed, dyed blonde Latinas making tortillas or chile rellenos in gorgeous Ann Taylor outfits and an outdoor Mayan design wood burning pit. I rise up out of the rose bush and immediately plunge into the standard Latino dramatic effect, the painful, ay, 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 ay. There's a gash on my finger. It starts to bleed pretty badly. Abuelita turns on the hose and, and runs my hand under the water. Inspecting my finger, she laughs, pitches my cheek, thanks the Virgen for the minor miracle, does a sign of the cross, and a prize primitive Latino first aid kit. She looks at me smiles, raises my bloody finger to her face. She closely inspects the afflicted digit. She brings it up to her eyes. I can't tell what she is looking for as if she's holding it up close. She might find some small lesson, some parable about the world and its workings. Her eyes canvas my finger slowly and carefully, and then quickly and without warning, she sticks my finger inside of her mouth and begins to suck on it. I feel the inside of her mouth, wet and warm. Her teeth are lightly pulling at my skin. This is both comforting and disgusting at the same time. <laughs> being in this womb feels like I've been eaten alive on one of those late night thriller chiller movies, Vampira, Senior Citizen Bloodsucker. <laughs> but it isn't that at all. This, this is the only way that Abuelita knows how to stop the bleeding. I've been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. I've been redeemed by the blood of the Lamb. See this finger? I cut it at work one day, making a, a pamphlet critical of those who would like to see us dead. Everyone in the room looks at me with apprehension. They're afraid to touch the bleeding, prefer to see it just gush, better than to have to question mortality and fate. I could go on about being tested, but it seems so futile as if we don't all know that one little HIV test could be wrong. I hold the finger in front of me and I stick it close to my mouth. It drips, drips, drips all over my desktop. I hold it to my face, inspecting it, and then quickly, without warning, I stick it inside my mouth and I begin to suck on it. Tears roll down my cheeks, salty, wet tears cover my face. I can feel my teeth lightly pulling at the skin. And I wish, I wish for an abuelita in this time of plague. I wish for an abuelita in this time of diseases. 
I wish for an abuelita in this time of loss. I wish for an abuelita in this time of sorrow. I wish for an abuelita in this time of shame. I wish for an abuelita in this time of grief. And I heal myself. I heal myself with primitive Latino first aid kit.